the Baker Heart and Diabetes Institute is, is really what the name says. We're, we're Australia's premier institute for research on cardiovascular health and for diabetes and the interaction between the two. And really the research agenda covers everything from the very basics in terms of cells through to clinical and population research. We uh, understanding diseases on a fundamental level and bringing that through to what we call clinical studies, which is mostly what I do, looking at how medications and illnesses and exercise affect people. From a personal point of view, doing research on endurance athletes, it's an extension of, of my work. I'm really fascinated on what effects endurance exercise have on the heart. It clearly causes quite profound changes, most if not all of which are extremely healthy, but it's understudied and we've still got a lot to learn. One thing I know as an athlete and a coach and in any field is you don't know what you don't know, right? It's important to recognise that and seek out someone who maybe does know. transition waiting for Tracy to come out and basically it's a tag so you take the timing chip so you take it off and give it to you put it on your leg and off you go maybe ride that first part of town and go to Matthew Flinders the steep hill because it's not far it's maybe 10k from the heart of town you can ride out there climb it so I work in the public affairs team and our role is to um, communicate what we do here at the Institute to talk about the prevention, diagnosis and treatment of cardiovascular disease and diabetes and to explain to um, the community why that's so important. I'm hoping to go up and enjoy it. Ocean swimming is pretty new for me so you know obviously competing first time is going to be a new experience so you know, it's exciting and I guess it's um, a bit daunting at the same time. As a research officer in Julie's team at the Baker, what I do is I look after multiple projects. In talking with Nathan, what I learned was that the bike leg is actually going to be the worst, so that's great for me. Also, given uh, his background, it's actually not too late for me to maybe have a career change. And he is also really interested in the things that we do given his background as an athlete. So I'm a laboratory head at the Baker and so I oversee a lab of about 12 people. So I guess I've done some running before but I've never been involved in a team event so I think that's really interesting and exciting. I guess it'll be nice to run in a different environment and see what that's like. I have no idea what the course is going to be like but I'm just sort of doing it to have some fun and promote I guess health because I think that's really important. <laughs>